Well, how do there, people in the viewerverse? Tis I, Captain of the Steve, and today, Jumps, I'm going to be showing you something a little bit odd. So, when we was doing the weekend mission, when we ended off, me, Wolfie, and Kettle were messing about upon that moon that we left off on. If you didn't watch the weekend mission, I put the video in the top right-hand corner. It was a great laugh, as always, but anyway, the thing that we found that was odd is Wolfie just took off into space using his jetpack, and he flew up into the stratosphere. He could just carry on going and going and going. I tried it. The same thing freaking happens. This is on a low orbit planet. Let me jump over into game and let me show you the shenanigans. Okay, so the shenanigans is going to ensue any second now, people. But first, I'm going to put my freighter in the sky. I'm going to see if I can fly up to my freighter. This is going to be interesting because I haven't even tried this yet, people. So it's just an airless world, as you can see. Airless. And my game settings are set to normal, and everything is set to standard, you know, it's, it's, it's as it is. I have got my movement modules all fully tooled up, okay? So I've got a load of modules in there, I've got some S classes in there, and one of them is boosted as well, people in the view of us. Not that you can tell, because you can't see the freaking stats, can you, on this? But there's a technology area, loads of technology space left, so I haven't gone to town on this by any stretch of the people in the view of us anyway let's see if we can fly on up to the freighter where's it bloody gone there it is okay right get into my eye line let's go okay so all i'm gonna do is just hold down my jetpack button and you're gonna see here i'm gonna start flying up and then when my jetpack actually produces like so nearly there boom it's just gonna do these little puffs all i'm doing is just holding down the x button and it just carries on flying and flying and flying and flying it's going to take me a little while to get to my freaking freighter, but I think I'm going to make it, people. I think I'm going to be able to fly all the way up to my freighter, which is insane. Now, I have seen people put base computers down and then build like a massive structure as high as they can, then put another base computer and fly up as high as they can to get to their freighter, and then you can put some sort of ground-based parts on your freighter. But look how high I am. This is insane. I can just carry on going. This is freaking... In this is mentals. Anyway, I didn't check my life support on the way up. And you can see that my life support is slowly dwind... Well, I say slowly. It's got three freaking lines on it. It's going down rather rapidly, actually, people. So before I started this, I should have really addressed my life support and fully topped it all the way up. Oh, well. We live and learn. Hopefully we're not going to die while learning, chums, because that is... Um, it's going to be the race against time, isn't it, really? It's going to be me versus my life support. But this is going to take me a little while to get on up to that freighter in the sky. Then again, saying that, those frigates are coming into view a little bit easier now, aren't they, people in the view of us? If you're wondering what that noise is in the background, that's my little robot. That's Eilick. Let me just jump over to there for a second. There he is down there. You see him? So, um, I give him a little tap. See if we can cheer him up a bit. Oh. Nope. He's going freaking ballistic at me now, people. <laughs> cheer up. Cheer up, dang it. Oh. The jellyfish are fine. They're always fine. They're always freaking happy, mate. They're always good. Anyway, let's go back to the actual game. There we are. And here we go. Nearly there. Nearly there. You can almost see the colour of my freighter now. Yeah, it's red and black. It's coming into view anyway. But that live support is worryingly low now. Um, Because, yeah, I could charge it up. I'm going to have to be very quick. And as soon as I do, I'm going to start dropping. So I'm going to lose some of my progress. I'm going to chance it. Let's see if we get there before I freaking run out of oxygen, people, in the view of us, shall we? So while this is going off in the background, let me just uh, bring it up on screen again, make it a little bit larger. I'll just show you some of the other stuff I've got in the background. So I've got some battle beasts. I've got some battle beasts on the top shelf. That one. This is a battle beast. It's a little bat one. You see him? Isn't he cool? Yeah, retro toys, those. I've got some Starcom. So Starcom, they've got little magnets in the bottom of their feet as well. So these are some of the smaller things in the background that you guys probably can't really make out. So yeah, I, I like all the retro stuff. I used to really like Starcom when I was a kid. Dino Riders as well. Uh, I've got a Dino Rider. I've got two Dino Riders. I haven't got many of them. I liked the bad guys more because bad guys were cool. Look, there's, there's one of the little snaky ones. Yeah, and he sits, he sits underneath my screen on a Stormtrooper rubber ducky. <laughs> <laughs> How cool's that? Anyways, um, are we any closer? This is this is taking a freaking while. I thought this would be a riveting video to make, people. 
but <laughs> I'm still not there yet. Uh, but yeah, you can see the colorization coming in a little bit more. You can see my Normandy there. Um, I don't think I can speed this up any faster. And I, I, as, as, I'm getting close, but I'm, I'm, I'm starting to worry about that live support. But oh, here we go. We're swimming in space now. Oh, fudge. I've, I've lost all life support. All systems are crud. Okay, um, boom. Give me back my life support. Let that we better fall back down to the planet, people, before we freaking die. Okay, so it looks like you can't actually fly all the way up to your freighter. But you get the idea, people. That's pretty good freaking fun. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's now a thing. You can now fly all the way up into freaking space mate or pretty much i mean this has taken a while for me to fall all the way back down to the freaking ground but i was hoping i might be able to fly up to my freighter sadly that's not doable but at least we tried it's pretty darn interesting that you can fly all the way up that distance is it a bug is it a feature i don't know but you've now seen captain steve running in space look at me go freaking mantles people in the view of us <laughs> look at him look at that what the fudge is going on there okay we're getting close to my ship now i need to i need to execute my jetpack right at the right time or else i'm gonna go splat this is gonna be a little bit breaky leggy moment isn't it all right okay i think about now might be a good enough time to do it yeah and then we can just sort of float on down there we go lovely jubbly people in the view of us so i didn't quite make it all the way up to my freighter but there you are there's something to play with have a little play on airless worlds people inside the view of us yeah i don't know what's going on there didn't used to be able to do that can do it now so there we are peeps yeah i want to say a massive great big thank you to warfy who found that out while we was on the actual live stream and uh, thank you guys for tuning in and watching excellent day cheery bye